Tonight, Fayetteville High School students bringing some attention to the homeless problem in this area. It's the school's 25th annual homeless vigil. Five News reporter Rachel Williams takes us there. Students will stay in temporary shelters overnight to understand and demonstrate what families who are experiencing homelessness in the community deal with every night. Thursday afternoon, students set up camp to live out their holiday tradition. So by doing our little part with our school district, we hope that we can make an impact and help those people. The event started with a student named Tommy Grace, who for years did it himself. Then he was approached by the student council here at the high school and said they wanted to be part of it. And so they did it together for a couple of years and then student council took it over all by themselves and have been doing it ever since. The Families in Transition program is a district program that provides housing, enrollment, transportation, and community resources to those students' families who may be living in non-permanent housing. They identified around 350 families, which was just a big shock because if you think about all of those households that need help that might be in jeopardy of losing their housing or they're currently in temporary housing, like living in a motel, a car, or a temporary shelter, it's just shocking to think that like there are so many people who come to school every day like that. For decades, the program has played a vital role in the district. We're always about moving the barriers that keep you from learning. If you're cold, if you're tired, if you're hungry, if you don't know where you're going to sleep tonight, you're not going to pay attention in class. You can't. So that's our job to try to get those barriers out of the way. And last year we were able to help 40 families with the donations we collected from the homeless vigil. And that's just amazing that our community has given so much and we're hoping this year to help a lot more. They'll also be selling Fayetteville High School apparel until 11 tonight. All proceeds go towards the Families in Transition program. In Fayetteville, covering news where you live, Rachel Williams, 5 News. A few students have also volunteered to shave their heads or get a mohawk or mullet during the school's pep rally tomorrow morning if they raise $200 or $250 or more individually.